How do we factor this polynomial? Remember the first step in factoring? Look for a common factor to be factored out other than 1 or negative 1. Well, in these two terms there's a common 3a. Here's another a, but no common 3. And then there's no a here. There's no factor that's common to all four terms except 1 or negative 1. So let's continue. Next, I would count the number of terms. Since there are four terms here, we're going to try factoring by grouping. So let's try grouping the first two terms. What's common to just the first two terms? What would be common is 3a. So I'll factor a 3a from the first two terms only. If I do so, I'll have a plus b. Now look at the second set of two terms. And what is common to this second set of two terms? Well, there's a 7. In fact, I'm going to factor out a negative 7. Now be very, very careful. What is negative 7a divided by negative 7? It is positive a. And then negative 7b divided by negative 7, it's positive or plus b. And you can check by multiplying. Negative 7 times a, that's negative 7a. Negative 7 times b, negative 7b. What am I looking for here? I'm looking for a common factor in these two terms, and there is a common a plus b. So I'm now factoring out the common a plus b. If I take it out of this term, I have left 3a. And if I factor it from this term, I have minus 7. Here's the factorization. Make sure you check by multiplying these two factors to see that we get the original polynomial.